So PP2A regulates a protein called tau. And tau is a microtubule-associated protein. So in a neuron, you have a, 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 a structural system in the neuron, which are microtubules. And a good way to think about microtubules, it's almost the skeleton of the, of the cell, right? So it gives the cell its form, right? And it also is train tracks of the cell. So it allows things to move around the cell, right? A neuron and other cells as well, but we're, we'll talk about neurons, right? Because, because that's, what, that's what gets messed up when you have uh, dementia and you, 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 you have bad memory and you age, your neurons age and die. And so microtubules are, are really the transport system and the give, give the neuron structure. So this tau protein, makes up these microtubules. Neurons have, have these long extensions called axons that some, sometimes can be you know, up to a yard long or so of these very, very narrow channels which lead to the connections to other neurons, and synapses. And uh, those channels have the microtubules, so it's like a railroad track, and they're, they're motor proteins that, that transport stuff to and from the synapses where they connect to other nerves and that's the way the nervous system works. PP2A regulates this tau protein. And so when, and, and in order for tau to do its job and, 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 and play its role in having very, very solid microtubules that are healthy and are able to do the job that they are meant to do, um, PP2A has to be in its optimal state. And PP2A's optimal state is, is what EHT promotes. And so by, by taking me sports, um, and, and which is active component of it, which is EHT, that promotes PP2A to be in its most functional state, which allows it to regulate tau and have very robust microtubule formation. And the microtubules are essential for that axon, for that synapse to happen. And so that's one of the things that'll happen when you get microtubules start to get messed up, is that synapse will disconnect. And that is what makes up your brain, is all these connected synapses. And so when you start to lose memory, that means these synapses are breaking. You're and losing those connections. Losing those and connections. those connections are what, what constitutes memory. So, so you, uh, and learning. It's who you are as a person. And so all those connections and the randomness of those connections and those connections happen, and that's how your brain forms its roadmap of the world and is you. So your, your perception, your memories, who you are as a person are the amalgam of all those synapses.